We begin tonight in Maricopa. Police shoot and kill a man accused of making threats while waving a gun. So this all unfolded this morning. Detectives still on the scene tonight. Fox 10's Marissa Sarbak is live with the latest. Marissa. Brian, Linda, we don't have too much information yet from Maricopa PD, but we are told that happened about 9 o'clock this morning. And again, we are still on scene. They are still on scene. There's crime scene tape still up at this point, and police patrol cars are behind us as well. So far, this is what we know. Maricopa officers responded to a home here around 9 o'clock for a man who was armed and making threats. Now, police have not specified what those threats were or who he was making them towards. When officers arrived, they say he engaged and then they shot him. It's also not clear how many times Times the man was shot, but we are told officers and paramedics immediately started life-saving efforts before he was transported to the hospital. He was pronounced dead from his injuries at that hospital. Maricopa PD has not yet released the name of a man who was shot and killed yet, but a neighbor just a few houses down says she was able to figure out which house it happened at when she woke up this morning. Over there by the landscape, that's the landscape's house. We know because he have a car, like a landscape car. And then I came out, I saw, but and then I did, and I told my mom, it might be something really bad. We don't know much people here. I just, just know the two neighbors because we've been here for, I've been here for over five years. But it's very quiet here. And of course, that was until this morning here on Robbins Drive in the Homestead community here. The crime scene tape has been up and it actually wraps all the way around the block. So residents simply have not been able to get through and go through this road. We are told again, Maricopa PD is actively investigating this case. We are expecting an update from them as of tomorrow morning. We'll keep you updated if we get any new information as this case unfolds. We are live here. Marissa Sarbach, Fox 10 News. Linda, Brian.